As temperatures increase around the world, cooling is emerging as a new basic need in all walks of life. The lack of adequate cold chains of refrigerated warehousing and transport causes 2 million vaccines preventable deaths each year. Food wastage occupies a land area almost twice the size of Australia, consumes water three times the volume of Lake Geneva, and emits 3.3 billion tons of carbon dioxide, making it the third biggest emitter after the US and China. Households spend between 35 to 42 percent more on electricity when they adopt air conditioning. Poor populations living and working in heat stress regions who cannot afford the most efficient cooling appliances end up spending more and having less money to invest in food and education and become more vulnerable to climate impacts. Cooling is a crucial solution for tackling poverty, hunger, health and climate change. However, the cooling solutions available today primarily respond to a society where supply of energy is not a constraint. If the existing cooling solutions are deployed in order to meet urgent demands of the most vulnerable, it will not only result in future burden of increased energy costs, but also result in increased pressure on the planet due to emissions. According to one estimate, refrigeration and air conditioning cause 10% of global carbon dioxide emissions, three times more than that from aviation and shipping combined. Since most of India's energy systems are centralized and rely on dirty, expensive fuels for reliability, innovations in clean cooling technologies and efficiency in cooling could provide cooling at lower environmental and financial costs. Sustainable Energy-Led Climate Action Program or CELCAP's Decentralized Renewable Energy Solutions address these energy gaps in cooling for poorer populations, their businesses and lifestyles. Using SDG 7 or affordable and clean energy as a catalyst, CELCAP is helping people tackle two of the major threats of our times, climate change and inequality. Cold Storage, Agri and Commercial India's cold chain networks require 62 million metric tonne of cold storage, the lack or inefficiencies of which leads to 30% of food being spoiled. Initial analysis shows that meeting the gap in this need through decentralized solar-powered cold storage units can avoid emissions equivalent to 29 power plants. Cellcap solar-powered cold storage units support retail and agri-perishables at the farm level, making refrigeration available in regions of heat stress and enabling farmers and other small commercial businesses affected by climate uncertainties to save their inventory and diversify their product and income base. Cool Sheds and Vaccine Refrigerators for Animals Lack of cooling also impacts livestock who also fall victim to heat stress. Increasing temperatures impact the health and reproductive efficiency of livestock, lower their immunity and cause about 20% loss in animal produce, causing great income losses to livestock rarers. Cellcap provides custom-designed cool animal sheds to reduce heat load on animals by around 30 to 40%. With increasing climate uncertainties, disease burdens on animals are bound to increase, highlighting the need for timely vaccines which are difficult to get in rural areas due to lack of refrigeration. Cellcap provides active cooling technologies for storing and transporting livestock vaccines in rural areas. Cooling comfort and timely vaccines reduce disease incidences in livestock and thus minimize the cost of veterinary care and production losses for livestock farmers, shielding them from the impacts of climate shocks. Cooling comfort for schools and health centers. Children are also highly vulnerable to climate stresses. 
children spend a large part of their days in schools. The quality of comfort at schools can have a significant impact on their mental and physical growth. However, 36% of schools in India are not electrified and many others have unreliable electricity, making it impossible for them to adopt cooling technologies. Poorly designed classrooms and indoor spaces also add on to heat distress. Lack of basic cooling amenities like fans and coolers during summers and heat waves disrupt school timing and hamper the well-being of students. Cell-cap solar-powered cool schools utilize active solutions like efficient lights, fans, coolers, and passive methods like retrofitted windows, ventilators, shaded courtyards, and play spaces for improving thermal comfort. Improved lighting and ventilation reduces energy load on existing systems and thereby energy costs. Overall, the decentralized cooling solutions for schools lead to higher attendance and better learning experience for children. Similarly, CellCap also improves cooling comfort in health centers across climate-vulnerable regions in India. Ill-planned health spaces, especially in heat-stressed regions, trap heat and moisture and cause heat discomfort for patients and staff. Increased heat stress increases certain types of diseases, leads to high-risk pregnancies, and increases burden on individuals suffering from musculoskeletal disorders. Most health centers in India are not designed to handle increased heat and need better ventilation and lighting which reduces discomfort in patients. Through both active and passive solutions, CellCap is preparing health centers for the future by helping them adapt to impacts of heat and uncertain climates. With increasing climate stressors, even places which did not require cooling before are feeling the need and burden of accessing more cooling solutions and thus more energy. CellCap fulfills this energy gap for the marginalized and climate vulnerable populations through its decentralized renewable energy cooling solutions. These energy solutions can be easily customized and used in varying contexts, making it easily scalable for the climate resilience of the poor.